Hello everybody! I am Lucas or Spidon from the Flame team and uh, just now we released Flame 1.17.0 and uh, with this release we get a new exciting feature which is a DevTools extension. Uh, so after you have, and I'm just gonna show you quickly what it is so that you know how to use it. Um, and if you just start your app as you usually do through your IDE or your terminal, then you can open the dev tools, the Flutter dev tools. And from IntelliJ or Android Studio, you open it by pressing this little symbol here. And in the terminal, you just get a link to click. And in the VS Code, it's something similar to this one. And then you will get up something like this. So here I have my examples running, and these are the these are the normal like flame examples. And here are the Flutter dev tools running in the browser. And now you can find a new tab here in the bottom called flame. And in here you get the component tree and you can select components, get a little bit more information from them. And you can pause the current running game and uh, yeah, unpause it. And you can step your game forward if you want to, like slowly, which might be good for debugging. And you can also like choose specific components here and then you get a little bit more information as I said. And you can turn on debug mode on them. Uh, or you can, yeah, if we choose one that has a little bit more of them here, you can also press enable debug mode up here and it will enable debug mode for the whole game, which is quite useful. Uh, and if you want to, if the component tree only reloads when you press reload here, so then you can press reload and you get all the new components there. And then you can choose what components you want to enable and disable the bug mode for, etc. Yeah, that's uh, all I was going to show you for today. And if you have any ideas of what more things we should put into this DevTools extension, please uh, shout out on our Discord or in the comments or something. And uh, Hopefully, I'll be happy to implement it for you. Have a great Easter, everybody.